bro, at the end of the day, like I said, man, I'm only giving you facts. And the facts is, they had me under investigation for 11 years, 12 years, and me and you share a history of nine, 10 years, and you're not in this. Hey, somebody would be just like, somebody that, that, that's on the outside that don't know nothing about this federal would be like, well, that's just what it is. Maybe he was smart. And somebody that know this shit gonna be here and say, nah, bro, that don't work like that. There was more to it. It don't work like that. It don't work like that. It don't work like that. You hear, they, they, I told you, they had me on investigation from 88 up. But yet, you can hear reasonable doubt say we've been getting money since 88. So you around, you clarifying that you around, right? Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. You know what I mean? Um, a lot of people thinking about this is a hate book, I'm a tell-all book type of situation, but it's basically just about my life, you know, how I dealt with this. Mm. The things that got me How packed. big the book gonna be? How many pages? Yeah, I got you something to read. It's a motivational <laughs> book. I got you something to read, man. Now, I'm, this That's why I want people to be like, yo, is it, what, yo what kind of book is... Yo, if this don't motivate you, right, to... To 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 become a leader, cause that's the mm. that's my goal right here. That's my purpose. I see what God got for me to lead, to be a leader in some pos whatever positive way that I'm gonna end up be doing. Right. But um, it's to show people like how the game goes, how people could count you out, how people can be show the utmost disrespect for, to you, right, and your family. And you still maintain, uh, you know, and get through it, and come and still see a positive way in it, it's a positive outcome from this. Don't matter what, you know what I'm saying. And, and where forgiveness will get you, mm. you know what I mean. And I think this will motivate them a lot. Is know? Emory in the book? Definitely. So that's because that was hurt and pain. You know what I'm saying? That was hurt and pain. The, the, you know what I mean? For your, for just the people that you you you, you uh, sacrificed the most for to turn. Because you to, tried to, to help Emory to understand his case to where he may have not even gone to jail. Oh no, nah, he was going. <laughs> they called him. They he called him. He just wasn't going that time. They would have They would have circled back around. He was going. <laughs> he was going. I thought you you know if he'd have fought it. And you knew they didn't have you right. Right, yeah. But that was just, you know, he would, you know his lawyer would have probably told him, Wait, don't waste your time because they're going to come back and retry you. Yeah, because he was right on the money with yeah. it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? And he that's, was right on the money. And that's crazy how I meant to tell you too, uh, even on uh, one of the songs, you see how he Emory Jones is on the, he calling Emory Jones on the phone from where he locked up. Which song is that? Uh, Do You Want to Ride? This is the operator with a collect call from Emory Jones to accept the charges. One now. That's Kingdom Come. Okay. Do you want to ride? Do you want to ride? You see how he shout Emory out, yo? You know, from the jail cell, this and that. None of that. I got none of that. Emory, what up? Tell Jane to go write letters and all. Shout out write rhyme. That's that's the crazy part. But but then he did give you something. He was giving you the fact of you was more entangled with him <laughs> than, than, than Emory. Emory was not that. Emory was light, light when it came down to his leg, to his what he what his scope was as a as a hustler, as a as this person he portrayed in these rap songs. You was more, you was you was who he was homing in on because of the hustle, right? But you know, I, and I, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Emory played a, a huge part in that success. He played a very huge part in that success. How? Because I feel that nothing. You ask me, Jay Short changed him. How? But hey, if he happy, that's fine. I was, even if he, but he's part of the legacy, and he's 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 getting to be a part yeah, of that whole thing. So that's, how that, is he short changed? How is he shortchanged? You think about it. If you you look at his him being shortchanged, if he's shortchanged, you definitely you, shit, you ain't getting no change at all. You know what? Everybody uh, is different. I guess. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. You you because that's something that me. Um. 
I wouldn't be I wouldn't be in the shadows of Jay. You get what I'm saying? That may be why I you're not been with in him. the shadows of Jay. That's probably why you you're not there. Think about that. Yeah, what you I'm saying, nigga? You, right? you say, <laughs> say let that. me go away. <laughs> he not and gonna I'm gonna do you. I'm gonna do that much time for you, and I'm gonna come back home, and I'm gonna be in your shadows. It's me personally. I'm not that guy. I'm not that character. Now you but see, some people you just said is something. okay with that. You just said. I go to jail for you. I don't know the case. <laughs> what the what the I'm hell just you just say? Like, Emory, how I mean, did Emory go to jail for Jay? Because you no, know, at the end of the day, he was on the streets doing his thing with Jay in mind. You see what I'm saying? Um, Jay could. I mean, Emory could have made bad situations. He could have made. He could have made it bad for Jay. But then again, he couldn't because guess what? They ain't asked about Jay, and and that's a problem. <laughs> but he could have brought Jay into the scenario. Yeah, yeah, you. you can't bring him into nothing if they don't want him. That's how they play. Oh man, you know what I'm saying? They want who they want. They they don't want to hear nothing else. You know how they work. But but do you think they? When you think about Jay, do and I gotta ask you this. Do you think Jay, why would they not ask about Jay? I, I ask you like that. Why would they not ask about Jay when Jay on the phones, unless the phones you, tapped, you involved. the phones tapped, everything's, everybody unless knows. Unless you involved. Unless they got something, unless, unless you involved. Unless you involved. Because you say you wasn't on the phones, you had already broke away from it. Already broke away. But the conversations in the hood was still going still on. Still circulating. But you wasn't on those conversations. I wasn't on nothing. But then you get called the snitch. That's how they want to, you know, change the narrative. So you think that's a decoy? That's a decoy. That's a cold decoy. You read my post. If you ain't been on my Marcy May page, you see it. You ain't no cop, Jay Reed. <laughs> you ain't no cop. Yeah, he was. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is, bro. At the end of the day, like I said, man, I'm only giving you facts. And the facts is, they had me on the investigation for 11 years, 12 years, and me and you share a history of 9, 10 years, and you're not in this. Hey. Damn. Somebody would be just like, somebody that, that that's on the outside that don't know nothing about this federal shit would be like, well, that's just what it is. Maybe he was smart. And somebody that know this gonna be here and say, nah, bro, that don't work like that. There was more to it. It don't work like that. It don't work like that. It don't work like that. You hear, they, they, I told you, they had me on investigation from 88 up. But yet, you can hear reasonable doubt say we've been getting money since 88. So you around. You clarifying that you around, right? <laughs> wow, that's crazy. You know what I'm saying? But they don't want Wait you. Wait a minute. So you telling me really the confirmation is out there. The the the, the confirmation, the information for all of this all stuff. All that is out there, man. On you know the records. Saying? People just, you know what? People just don't want to see. I didn't want to know that it wasn't no crying, no Santa Claus when they told me. Like, what? You lying? Well, how was that? That's how they feel about Jay. You know what I'm saying? Like, they don't want to believe that that can be an uh, issue. That can be true. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.